Here's a super fast, no fluff guide on how to wall bounce in Apex Legends, starting with the most basic wall bounce to the more advanced. First, I bound mouse wheel up to move forward so that I can tap strafe, and I bound mouse wheel down to jump. A basic wall bounce looks like this. Breaking it down, look right at the wall, press Shift and W to build up momentum, slide, hit your jump input, let go of all your keys, and when you make contact with the wall, hit your jump input again. Here it is in slow motion. Next is the horizontal wall bounce, which is the same as a regular wall bounce, except you're running at an angle to the wall and you need to move your mouse to look at the wall for it to work. Also, you can press one of your movement keys to determine the direction you want to go after hitting the bounce. It's not required to hit a movement key, but it can be helpful. One of the best uses of this technique is using it to move forward when you're running away, making yourself harder to hit. Breaking it down, run to build momentum, slide, jump, Make sure that you're looking at the wall when you make contact, and hit your jump input and the movement key corresponding to the direction that you want to go at the same time. Here it is in slow motion. You can also tap strafe into wall bounces. If you don't know how to tap strafe, I made a minute long video on that. Breaking it down, build momentum, slide, jump, and tap strafe towards the wall. When you make contact, jump. Here it is in slow motion. You can tap strafe out of a wall bounce too. Run, slide, jump, look at the wall, and jump when you make contact, and then tap strafe. In this example, I both tap strafe in and out to show you that you can chain techniques together. Once you've practiced a bit, a good spot to test is right here. Slide underneath the beam and wall bounce across the gap. Another good spot to test is here. Line yourself up with the zip line and aim for this light. Try to hit the wall in the general area of the light, and if you do it right, you'll jump onto or over the obstacle. I hope that this video gave you some good guidance, but remember that practice is the only way to master the technique. If this video helped you, please consider liking it. In the next video, I'll go over how to wall bounce off of any object.